So it's the end of the season and it's time to head to Area 27. This is our last chance. The track is about to close and we really needed some footage and some really nice photos for a client. All right, so for today, our main goal was to get some on-track footage, some photos and some videos of this beautiful, rare car. I've never seen one of these before. This is absolutely gorgeous and we're very, very excited and very fortunate to be able to film and take photos of this car on track. All right, guys, let's get into this episode and we're gonna dig right in and show you exactly how we got these photos and this video clips on track at Area 27. All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna do something a little bit different. We got the mad scientist here, Carson. Uh, we're gonna get some photos. We're at Area 27. We got something special for you today. We're gonna do some behind the scenes, some real cool up and close, up close and personal footage at the track, how we get rollers, both photo and video. We're gonna show you guys exactly how we get that. We got all the gear and everything for our filming and photo rig. We'll do a walk around in another episode. I'll go over the entire thing, all the modifications we've done and some other mods and plans we have for it. For now, we've got a couple of really cool cars around the track, race cars, some super pimped out BMWs, and an ultimate GTR for the video and photo shoot today. All right, so we're gonna start getting everything ready. Uh, I gotta get my harness on. Um, I've modified this so that some of these side windows come out and then the sunroof always came out, but uh, we're gonna take that out. So we got lots of windows, a lot of places to get different shots from on the side, cars going by, and the rear hatch obviously will be open. We'll have our safety harness on so we can hang out right close to the ground and get all that good action. A real fast looking footage. We wanna make sure we get the best stuff that we can possibly can from all different angles. So we're gonna clean this out so we got lots of room. Like I said, I'll go over later exactly why we believe this Honda Element is one of the best cars for shooting both photo and video footage. So let's get the GoPro helmet cam on and get some behind the scenes track footage right now. Here we go. You want me to stay to the left of them? Sorry? You want me to stay to the left of them? Uh, or what do you want? Yes. Yes? Yeah. 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 I got everything I need. <laughs> okay. I'm just gonna shoot at 20. All right, we're good. Yeah. It's still yeah, super I got fun. 50, I did 50. Okay, oh, 50. Now we're, now we're talking yeah. some.
some real numbers. I think this Honda Element tops out at 50 anyway. So. Especially firing on three and a half yeah, cylinders. Yeah, three and a half cylinders. Yep. Yeah, that's a story for another episode. <laughs> and until then. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed us at the track filming. In another episode, we'll go more in depth of how Carson gets some of his photos, as well as the video footage, some of the tricks that we do when we get these shots that we do. And uh, yeah, so we'll go more in depth next time, but I hope you enjoyed that quick episode of us on the track getting some rolling shots. Check out GolairAutoGroup.ca. It's gonna be an awesome website with a lot of stuff for sale, a lot of aftermarket parts, performance parts, tuning, you name it, everything's gonna be on that website. It's gonna be awesome. So go check it out and follow Victoria Car Spotting. Go follow Carson right now. It's dope.